School is out, but for those battling coronavirus on the front lines, work is still on. And to help out, the YMCA has partnered with districts in our area to offer critical child care. As KZI 9 News reporter Emma Jerome shares, us, uh, shares with us, it's an option that provides much needed relief for families in need. My first thought was, how do I make this happen? Empty parking lots and abandoned playgrounds are what you'll find at most schools these days. And with the lack of school, that has left some parents who still have to work scrambling for child care. Enter the YMCA. There's hundreds of families in the community right now who need this type of care because workers and families are out there being heroes to all of us. The critical care program is an expansion of pre-existing services, which also offers distance learning support for children of health care workers, first responders, and essential workers. They have 289 spaces for children at multiple different sites, one of those sites being Holt Elementary, where Whitney's child is. But this is not a 4J exclusive program. The YMCA has partnered with 4J along with Springfield Public Schools, South Lane School District, Bethel, as well as some rural area schools. While keeping the children in their care, the YMCA is also following strict health guidelines. Every morning there's a health screening, the kids get a temperature check. Even as a parent, I'm not allowed in the building. In the program, we're maximizing outdoor play as much as possible. And when children are in a closer group, such as a meal time, we're ensuring that there's social distancing and physical distancing. Freeing the family's minds of worry while they are out there fighting to keep our community safe. In Eugene, Emma Jerome, KEZI 9 News.